I didn't set a red line. The world set a red line. The world set a red line when governments representing 98% of the world's population said the use of chemical weapons are abhorrent and passed a treaty forbidding their use even when countries are engaged in war. The use of chemical weapons in Syria uh, is not only a tragedy, uh, but also uh, a violation of international law that must be addressed. Failing to respond to this outrageous attack would increase the risk that chemical weapons could be used again, that they would fall into the hands of terrorists who might use them against us. The question is, what are we, we collectively, what are we in the world going to do about it? We are the United States of America. We are the country that has tried, not always successfully, but always tried to honor a set of universal values around which we have organized our lives and our aspirations. The plane they use is the provider, or C-123. Each one carries a thousand gallons of defoliant, which is very like ordinary weed killer in common domestic use in America. It comes in three main types, Agent Orange, Agent Blue, and Agent White. This crime against conscience, this crime against humanity, this crime against the most fundamental principles of international community, against the norm of the international community, this matters to us. When the United States of America and the world say never again, we don't mean sometimes, we don't mean somewhere, never means never. Never.